Hello, my name is Loopy Fist, and welcome back to TCG Card Shop Simulator, where I've been playing, I think we're on day what? Uh, we're on day 88, and we are attempting to give a quick update, is all, that's, that's really it. So basically, in this game, I have been playing for quite a while, um, and I've made some changes, and I just wanna go over those changes real quick, because what you really end up doing in this game a lot is opening up a lot of cards and we've opened up a lot of cards, at least, I would say we've opened up at least a hundred thousand cards probably, maybe, maybe packs, I don't know, wait, how many, how many packs have we opened? It has to be over a hundred, well, close, maybe 50,000, I don't know. I wish there was a way to know. Anyways, I wanna show you guys what I've done with the place. So basically, I don't know if the last video we had showed we opened up the shop B, but we do have the shop B and we've expanded this a little bit. We got some, we need to get this area on, open up over here, but we have a workbench and we open this up and we have things organized. We got some of our accessories over here as far as card boxes, dice. Here are all of our posters that we can get as well as the collector's um, little card booklet. Uh, this is the figurines we have the third level of figurines unlocked right now but there's also a cartoons one and also this little fox figurine as well that you can also get but we got our plushies first level figurines and then we have the second level of just this big hog as you can see if you go in here and look at the figurines got level one level two level three and we've only unlocked um the infer infer hog um, we haven't unlocked this one yet. This is in the next level at 34. Probably won't do another um, upgrade level or show it. No, do another update, update, la, 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 la. words, letters, things. I probably won't do another update until we actually get to the renovation of shop A to be available. And that one is going to be at level 37. So around level 37, maybe even level 40 because we won't unlock any more cards until level 40, any new cards. Um, we're waiting to get these epic, these epic destiny packs. When we get those, I'll probably do another update video and at level 40. That's a good little stopping point, you know? I may up give you guys another update, but I don't think there's a reason to, to put the entire gameplay on here anymore, simply because I'm just opening up a bunch of packs. I got 12K dollars right now, but bills are flipping high. As you can see, 1545 pay all those right now and it gets even worse um getting worse we got figurines here we have cards here all of our cards here we got base i've organized this pretty well we got basic uh le basic rare epic legendary then we have basic destiny and then we have rare destiny i think yeah rare destiny i would want to put it here but if i move it here you can't take these off right now like there's no way there's no mechanic to take these off so the stalkers they don't know what to do they're just pretty dumb so that's how i got that all set up we got other things here too we got a workbench you can actually bundle up cars with this didn't know that that's what it was for but it was, it was, I was kind of i was kind of intrigued to figure out what it was but you can bundle these up you can lay them on the desk there's a new update with this and that's pretty cool oh i also bought this new stink away what i'll call it but it's basically just a uh this a deodorizer got two of them and i found out that you can well i didn't find out somebody told me you can put it through the wall here and it'll it'll still blow people a little beat of blow action um so that's the main part of the warehouse now i'm working on this apparently i found out that the store cannot be made any longer this ways you can only go this way long so only this way long so i moved this stuff from over on this back wall and now we have our card packs over here. So we have these right here, which are, I forgot what they're called exactly. Um, just a, oh, it's a battle deck apparently. So you got the battle deck, we got the fire, the earth, the water, and then the air or wind, what's, what's the difference? Uh, and then we have all of our cards here and they're all in rows of threes. This is the only thing that has rows of fours on it, but it's a double sided. So maybe I'll upgrade to that later, but on the wall, this is kind of the most efficient, unless they add more stuff that lets you do things on the wall with fours. But right now we don't have it. We got basic, same way we got it up there organized from least to greatest. We got basic all the way through legendary regular. Then we got some dice right here. They're just a placeholder really. Until we start to unlock these for Destiny, these are just a placeholder. But then we have the Destiny packs, which is Destiny's move out of the way, Snake. Destiny basic and then Destiny rares. And then I'm starting to put, I started to put the boxes over here as well. So I can either consolidate these if I think that I'm putting too much out, 
but we have these in the same order we have the uh basic rare epic legendary and we're doing the same thing for destiny here we just don't have enough right now we don't have enough room in a lot of things i mean i added so many tables we have what 10 tables one two three four five yeah 10 tables that we got here it almost looks like a lunch room we got all of our little posters down here and figurines now one thing i'm gonna have to do is i'm gonna have to let these sell out i guess and then i'm gonna have to um fix this this is not broken what's going on with this well now i won't let me put it there get out of the way so this is not broken. It's just that it's in the wrong section. So if I flip it around, then it's right, but it's wrong still because this, these are my figurines. These are figurines. I want them to stay in the same area. So it's really a game issue. It's not me that this is not fitting right, which really sucks. We got our little collector's books there. We got the cartoons and the plush dog there. And we'll end up expanding this out because we got way more to push back on, right? But we got the plushies on this side and we have some more of these posters here we got plenty over here too but we just needed some other section and this should be all the posters that are available then we got some deodorant over here this is where i can put those little boxes we made in, in the back the little bundle boxes they can go over here on the side we got some card sleeves little basic ones and then we have our card boxes and last but not least we have our cards here now the best one i got right now is this one $2,289 market price. We're selling it for $3,300. Gonna see if somebody can get it. I've sold one like that before. Um, and we gotta put some more of these out. Let's put this back up here. Put this down here, I guess. Or can I not go up there? Okay, I can't go under. That'd be fine. Well, you know what? I'm gonna put it back over here. Kick it in the corner. He'll, he'll get it. But basically, those are our best cards. Now, if you wanna know the best card that I've opened, that hasn't changed a whole lot. Still from the short, a lot of people you came over from the short, it's still this. You can make it go up in price if you play the right game um, for the day. But right now, its total market price is $12,765.43. So it's a pretty penny. Uh, but we've unlocked four ghost cards in total. We have this one, uh, the Hydron. Uh, actually, somebody in my chat actually got one of these, uh, I believe, and it was actually like $14,000 or maybe it was a hydro or oh, was a hydro I got. It was like $14,000 like shh, crazy. And then this one, Dracon is 376, but these are all nice. This is the nicest one I got because it has that foil and you don't see that very often. Apparently, I don't know how often you have a chance to get one of these, but when you get a ghost card, you have a one in 20 chance of it being a foil, which is crazy to think. Every time you get one of these, you have a one in 20. I just went from level, I went from level 30 to level 33 last night on stream. We didn't get a single ghost card. So you can see how rare it is. It's extremely rare. Anyways, that's my car shop for the most part. Oh, I guess I can talk about this. This is Cosma. This is one of my moderators. Um, he costs quite a bit of money um, to get up here. He's a nice fella, but he has the fastest uh, ringer router speed. He's not very good at stocking, which is why I won't put him out there. But we do have, uh, where's Snake at? Where is he? Here he is. Snake is out here um, not doing his job, but Snake is new. He's the fastest down stalker, but he sucks on the register. So we got a little bit of yin and yang going on here, but hey, don't bother me. As long as they're getting their jobs done right now, he could probably use a little bit of help. Um, I'll eventually hire somebody else to help him out. But right now he's doing fine, except for when he's taking my car boxes. But what I'm going to do real quick for you guys, because I haven't done it yet, is I am going to buy. Do I have to buy it? I think I do. Because he's put everything up. Do I have any cars across the street? Nope. How many do I need to buy? Let's see. I'm going to open up a box for you guys. I need about two boxes. So. Do 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 do. Let's buy two boxes of these. Basically, I'm buying two boxes because if I don't do that, he'll put one of them up. So I'm gonna take one. You know what? I'm gonna let him put it up because he's he's gonna grab it and I'm gonna hate him for the rest of the day. So we're gonna open up this box, see what we get. Hopefully, we get something good. If we don't, it's not my fault. It's the devs. They hate me. But let's see what we get out of this box because I don't want to start the game up, you know, do a whole entire day and stuff. And I mean, it's going to end up resorting to me opening a bunch of boxes all day. So I really just kind of like sit here and talk about the boxes that we're getting. We're getting a bunch of dog shit right now. But hey, um, 
hopefully that can change. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. They're, they haven't given us anything good at all yet. Nothing. And this is what happens later in the game. I think it might be because of the rare packs. I'm not sure, honestly, but I'm going to continue opening up these and hopefully we'll get something good. Everyone wants me to open my store, but it's still eight o'clock. I'm not late or early. I'm trying to decide if I'll be playing this today on stream or not. Probably will play some. Ooh, 1409. That's not bad, but we've been getting a lot of decent cards. Nothing fantastic. 1664. Great year, but not what I'm looking for. Uh, do, 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 do. Oh, also the upgraded speed to opening up cards has been stellar. You can change it to where it's like slower, but why would you want to do that? Open up the cards as fast, just rip them up and, and just play them down. Just, you know, decrease the value. Honestly, that would be really smart. It'd be really smart as if later in the game, they implement to where if you open up the cards really fast, okay, that was $20.30. That was the best we've gotten today. If you open up the cards fast, then you can reduce the value, have a chance, and that would make people have to like open them up slower. That would be devastating. Oh my God. The 2397 is the best card we got so far. Let's see. They really not want to give us anything. Wowzers, wowzers, wowzers. Come on, dudes. Let me let me show the YouTube that my pack opening skills are are not to be trifled with. This is my last shot. This is it, baby. If this if this ain't it, then I don't know what to tell you. We got we got to get something good right now. Oh come on, come on, come on! Don't don't do me like this. Oh man, it it, it really does suck when you get these boxes and it's just not worth it. Come on now. I got like three more packs to open. I think I might have miscounted. I'm not the I'm not the best counter. 1776. Look like twenty three dollars is gonna be our best card we got out of these packs, and that's not fine. Uh, uh, anyways, that's my store, and I hope you guys enjoy the way things are turning out. If you do, come follow me over on Twitch, and you can see us play this live. We have pretty good fun. And also tell me what you got. Join the Discord. You can drop your cards in the general chat. The link's in the description. Um, also, make sure you're subbed. Appreciate the hell out of you guys. And I will see you guys later. Bye.